This is an iron fuel tank with a thickness of 1.0 mm. We use a cold welder to weld and seal the outer corner of the fuel tank. The pulse current is 12. If you are a novice using a cold welder, it is not recommended to hold it by hand like I do. It will be unstable. This is the 1.0 mm iron fuel tank we just welded. Let's test its tightness. We use a pot of water to pour into the fuel tank. We can see that the water does not overflow. The welding effect is very good, and the sealing is very strong. The cold welder repairs the holes in the steel pipe and welds with carbon steel welding wire, which is very convenient. Welding cold welding effect is also great. We use the steel wire in the welding the pulse current 12, pulse time 16. The faster the welding bead shape like fish scales, joints and white very nice. Let's take a look at the high definition solder joints. We can touch them directly after soldering. These are two nuts. We weld the head of the nut half a circle and weld them together. The pulse current is 13, do you think the current is too large? When the gap between two plates is so large, it is wrong to use welding wire to weld directly. The correct method is to add welding wire from the bottom of the gap to the smallest gap and then fill it up slowly so that they can be welded to together. We weld the iron ball and the screw together. The gap is small, no wire is needed, pulse current, 11, while the first solder joint just follow the solder joint. Let's see the effect after welding. These are two zero dot for MN Kitchen stainless steel printing plates. Not only stainless steel plates can be welded, but metal sheets of 0.1 mm for mm can be welded. Copper, iron, aluminum, titanium, silver, gold galvanized sheets transfer plates, film coated board, imitation copper board, making varnish board, electrolytic board, sprayed board can be welded. Let's take a look at the results after welding. The advantages of no deformation, no blackening, stable arcing, beautiful appearance, no need for professional welders, no need for polishing and grinding, are deeply loved and respected by all walks of life in metal processing. Tips for cold welding machine welding Firstly, the tungsten needle should be ground into a cone shape not as sharp as argon arc welding. And then when welding, the tungsten needle point must be aligned with the middle of the weld. The distance between the needle point and the workpiece is controlled within 1 mm. The closer the better but not together. The angle between the gun and the workpiece is between 75 to 90 degrees. It's easy to master this. 